Thanks for joining us on Valley News Live here in North Fargo tonight with the Cashwise Backyard Barbecue. The weather perfect, a little bit of a breeze and so much cooler. The humidity seems to have taken a little bit of a break. Let's get to what's going on right now. Your current conditions at Hector International Airport, mostly sunny skies. We do have a few clouds drifting overhead, but nothing too much to be concerned about as we head into the evening. We're holding off into the upper 70s out there. That's been our high so far today with a north breeze at 15 miles per hour. Dew points are down in the 50s. So those we're up in the 70s last night with the soggy air in place. A lot of sunshine in Grand Forks and 77 gorgeous degrees there. Your wind also 15 miles per hour from that cool north northwesterly direction. Here is a peek at the regional temperatures and it's pretty uniform. 70 Bemidji is the cool spot. Low 70s in Devil's Lake right now, but a lot of mid and upper 70s from eastern North Dakota into Lakes Country. Here is a look at the satellite and radar and essentially it is extremely quiet here. Out to the west in the western Dakotas, we have some strong thunderstorms rumbling through South Dakota primarily. Notice the trajectory of those storms is southeasterly. That will carry that activity away from us. And Minneapolis has just end, seen storms pass through the area heading into western portions of Wisconsin and southeast Minnesota. Your hour-by-hour -hour forecast shows us what's going to happen to our rain chances overnight. And first and foremost, it does put a little bit of shower activity across Minnesota, but that likely will not transpire as temperatures will stay in the 70s all evening. The north wind should settle down a pinch as we head towards sunset tonight, especially west of the Red River. Notice the convection near Bismarck as we head to bed tonight. Watch where that moves during the overnight. Whoop, heads down to the south. We could see a sprinkle on the eastern side of the Red River tonight, but by and large, I'm not too confident that's actually going to take place. Your morning temperatures Thursday starting out in those comfortable 50s, even a few low 50s in the North Valley. By midday, temperatures rising through the 60s into the low to mid 70s south. Again, our model paints a spotty sprinkle of rain here or there. I can't rule it out, but I wouldn't plan on it. And here's your afternoon forecast. As we glide into our Thursday afternoon, it is showing spotty thunder shower or shower activity, not severe, and temperatures hovering between 75 and 80 degrees. And the evening looks pretty quiet. And notice your wind direction tomorrow, once again from the north at 5 to 15 miles per hour. So, your planner for Fargo in the morning, temperatures will be in those comfortable upper 50s to near 60 degrees. We'll see a high once again near 80 in the afternoon, mostly sunny skies and a north breeze around 10 miles per hour, making it perfect for a Thursday night softball game. Here's your hometown forecast. Out to the west, first Jamestown. Temperatures there in the afternoon, mid-70s. Low 70s in northeast portions of North Dakota, including Walhalla, Pembina, and Cavalier. Out in western Minnesota, we'll see a lot of low to mid 70s there for Lakes Country. Just a little chop on the water and enough of a north breeze to keep things refreshingly cool. A spotty shower, not out of the question, especially east of the Red River. Look at the wild clouds we had over Little Cormorant Lake last night, courtesy of RV, uploaded to valleynewslive.com. He called it storm swirl, the leading edge of that storm snaking back and forth across the Cormorant Lakes area. 83 on Friday, so we remain seasonal. The weekend brings the heat, and it looks like a chance for some thunder showers, especially on Sunday. We could see some Sunday morning. We could see more developing in the afternoon, and with the heat we'll have in place, they could be on the strong side. Next week, chance of scattered showers and thunderstorms and sizzling temperatures near 90 degrees. Joining me right now from Cashwise, Greg, I got to tell you, this is quite the party we have going on here. A lot of folks getting together. And if you at home have friends getting together this weekend for a cookout, what do you have at Cashwise? Well, we got a lot of great items at Cashwise. Right now we got our 20% lean ground beef on sale for $1.98 a pound. We have our Cashwise signature brat patties. They're fresh brat patties. They're 10 for 10. And then we do have the ribeye steaks on sale that you see on the grill here, a 12 ounce for $5.98. So I'm oh. sure this party is going to enjoy those. You bet. And I got to tell you, I've never had a bad ribeye at a Cashwise backyard barbecue they're outstanding thank you you bet and thank you gotta tell you our forecast for the upcoming weekend looks pretty hot so enjoy the cool while you can i'm going to go enjoy the uh condiments table here and make sure everything is up to snuff for the backyard barbecue back to you in the job. studio yes thank you hutch 
All right, tonight's uh, Village Inn Spotlight couple is Karen and Glenn Peterson from West Fargo. They're celebrating 25 years of marriage today. Congratulations, you two.